So today's freeze drying project is to make liver snacks for Sprite. Once these are dry, they'll be just crispy little liver nuggets. And we're sure that she's going to think that they're absolutely delicious. So rather than waste the liver from the cow that we had butchered a while back, we are making her some snacks. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get these trays of liver into the freeze dryer. Liver makes a great dog treat because it's high protein and super nutritious. And they also think it's really delicious. We're going to add the pad in here. This is to help insulate the freeze dryer. It's really difficult to get in one-handed. But we'll put that in. Close the door and make sure that it is fully latched and sealed. And then we're going to press start. We're going to choose not frozen, although this is a little bit partially frozen. This will make sure that it's all the way frozen if we choose not frozen. Come down here and close our drain valve. Press continue and the machine is starting. So we'll bring you back in about 24 hours when the freeze-dried liver treats are done. And we'll show you what they look like when they're finished, as well as doing a taste test with Sprite. All right, so our liver treats should be done now. We're going to open this up and double check that they Ready. We have to open the drain valve first, which I failed to do, so the chamber was still under pressure, or vacuum rather. Those appear to be nice and dry, so we don't need any more time. So we're going to actually tell the machine to defrost, because we have more stuff that we want to run today. And so now we need to remove everything from here. I've got to grab some gloves because those trays are extremely cold. So we'll bring you back and show you Spritey's taste test. Okay, so I got an oven mitt. When you pull these trays out, or when they initially are ready to come out, if you haven't caught it right at the end of the cycle, it takes it down to like negative 30 or something. So these trays are so extremely cold, they'll actually burn, cold burn your fingers if you're not careful. So I had to go get a hot pad from the kitchen so that we can get them out of here. And you'll notice a color variation on some of this liver. It was actually from two different cows. So that's why we're seeing a slightly different color there. So the machine will now defrost for two hours. We've made sure that our hose is over our bucket so that we don't make a mess on the floor. Let's take these inside and see what Sprite thinks. We've allowed the liver treats to come up to room temperature and we're getting ready to bag them. Now we're going to have Sprite do the taste test. Mm. 
She seemed to like the first one, but just in case, we'll give one more a try. I'd say those are a success. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to like and subscribe.